We're on the road earlier this morning, heading to a destination that's been on my list for a while, Cape Forshoe. It's a long drive, so we'll be making some stops along the way to explore and stretch our legs. Moose River Falls in Dippy County are not as popular or as large as the ones in Parsboro with a similar name, but they're still quite the sight. These falls are one of many that we have discovered through the Waterfalls of Nova Scotia guide by Benoit Lalonde. This book will keep us busy all year trying to hit all the destinations that they list. On the way down the 101 to Yarmouth, you can't help but notice Gilbert's Cove Lighthouse just off the road to the north. Although only 30 feet tall, when this lighthouse was in use it served the area for 80 years. It's now being maintained by a non-profit community group that dubbed this the greatest little lighthouse in Canada. Quite the opposite of Gilbert's Cove Lighthouse, the Cape Forshoe Lighthouse is only 5 feet wide at the base and 75 feet tall. It's said that this apple core style lighthouse reduces wind resistance. There are a lot of signs on site with lots of information on the history and design of this lighthouse. Just below the Lighthouse and Interpretive Center is the Leif Erikson Trail. This trail is only half a kilometer long but gives a variety of views of the Lighthouse and the shoreline around it. A unique point of interest is the 50 foot long whale skeleton that's on display next to the trail. Standing next to this really does give perspective of the size. And of course, we took a little time for some cattle dog photography.
On the way home, we went up the south shore and stopped at Pine Grove Park. This park is deceiving. Although from the roadside it looks small, it is actually 54 acres in size. There are a number of trails here, varying in lengths and intensity. Even on the cooler days, we make sure the cattle dogs stay well hydrated. For our last stop of the day, we came across this little park that gave a great view of the Mersey River. <laughs> 